everyone, it's Paul from Touchboard Australia. Today I'll be showing you the software side of the new Zenon Pro V4. So let's get started. Let's start by writing. We'll go into our writing application. Select our pen. You can use your pen, thin nib, thick nib, or your finger. You can decide how thick or thin you want it. So we'll start with the thin nib. You can select your colour. You can choose a colour that may not be on here. You've got your colour wheel. Press OK. We've now went with blue. Let's try a thick one. You can also turn this into an eraser. So we'll go back to here and you can start erasing on that. You can do the same with your finger. You can still erase larger surface with the palm of your hand or clear the whole page. There's also a little stroke function on here which I like. The thing is maybe a little bit different. Stroke there. It's got a lovely pen to paper type feel on this. So we'll take off the stroke. I'm gonna just write my signature. A little finer than that. Alright. You can uh, multi-touch. Still get you 20 points of touch. You can make things bigger or smaller. You can also move around. So this page could forever be scrolling. We'll go into a second page. Let's add some shapes in. Go triangle. Let's take off that green color. And just go white. There's an undo and redo. bond all this together. Take that away there. Grab it. We can move that. Bond it again. Duplicate it. Happy there. A few duplications. Take it off there. And again you can go bigger, smaller. Alright, we can import pictures. So here's some, this goes into our file network. You can bring up what pictures you require. This is one I had earlier. This is the mobile height adjustable center column. That's what this panel is currently sitting on. So you can put your picture in, make it big, make it small, paste it on when you're happy, and start writing to it. So go right, this is our mobile. You can change your background. So again, we'll add another page. We'll go into our backgrounds. We'll go right, green, blue. You can add on your own. New South Wales writing paper, white background, music paper, soccer pitch. We'll go back here. Okay. This is a great feature. Um, Split your screen, have maybe a before and after. Let's change our color here. We'll do a quick experiment. Walk of ice, let's mark it out so everyone knows. Let's put a fire under that block of ice. Again, let's mark it out. What's the after picture going to look like? Great for our kids to see the process, discuss, draw the after picture. 
Let's split the screen again and tell a story. Every story has a beginning, a middle, and an end. That can't go into there, that can't go into there. We've just read Goldilocks and the Three Bears. What happens at the beginning? The bears go out for a walk. So do, does Goldilocks. What happens in the middle? Goldilocks goes into the house. What happens at the end? The porridge is eaten, the bears are angry, she gets chased out. So you're reading the story, break it down, discuss. This board gives you that platform to do that. Let's go out of there. As I said earlier, undo, redo, do, clear the screen. I had the picture in here. Let's now leave our whiteboards. Oh, one other thing, sorry. I can go back to where I was. I'll show you how to save this board. You can save in several ways. You can share through QR code. You can save, which will end up in our file network. You can bring something onto the board previously. So I'll go right, I want to go a previous whiteboard, I want to put it on here. That was just an image I was playing about with the other day. And you can also upload this to the cloud, share it by email. I'm just going to quit it now, not save. All right, let's go into our app store. App store here, download what apps you require, Word, Excel, Maps, OneDrive. We're going to go to a world map here. Loads on. Can zoom in. Still all interactive, and you can also annotate over that. You can annotate over any application. So pens still work the same way. Where's Australia? Here is Australia, and New Zealand. Undo, redo. Can someone point out where? Let's go our select tool. Zoom it in a little bit. Can someone point out where South Africa is? Here we are. We'll go blue on this. There is South Africa. All right, let's go arrow. What we're going to do now, we're going to keep this map, but we're going to split the screen again in half. It's a bit different to the last um, split screen I showed you. You can split this and then open up completely different application to this. So we'll go right, let's put on a whiteboard. Oh, this is loading. Let's just zoom on this again. It's still pretty big. I want to cover this area. There's a specific reason for that. We have our whiteboard. Lots of templates if you want to, but I'm just going to go freestyling here. And let's talk about Europe. I want to maybe add some text. Type in here, keyboard comes up. Where? Space. Europe? Question mark. I'm happy with that. Let's make it bigger. All right, Excel it there. Board. Let's size it down. Here we go. 
Now let's uh, have a bit of fun. Let's add the spotlight tool. Is this your up? No. Is this your up? No. Could this be your up? Yeah. Exit out. Let's post a series of questions here facing it on your up. And let's do a quick pop quiz. We'll put a timer on. 10 seconds. If you haven't answered, the buzzer will go after 10 seconds. There we are. There's something else I like on this. The source. That's your normal source. Oh, HDMI 1. What do I have plugged in in HDMI 1? HDMI 2. What do I have plugged in again? What's running there? Let's go source preview and find out. I'm actually going to take it off split screen a moment. Let's close split screen. Here we are, source preview. I have our little, the TouchBoard OPS running with this as well as Android. I can go straight into that. Here we are. We've got everything here. Back to our home screen. There's so much more I need to show you on this. We still haven't covered eShare. App free wireless mirroring, the cameras, which I'll be doing a series of other videos, which will be on our YouTube channel. So have a watch. Any questions, please feel free to contact me. Thank you for watching.